a verdict, verdict of guilty which has confirmed our belief that Cashman murdered our beautiful Olivia. Olivia was just beautiful with her long brown hair and big brown eyes. She was such a social butterfly. She was particularly good with the younger children and was such a caring little girl. Liv was the light of our lives, a sassy, chatty girl who never ran out of energy. She was a character. She was my baby and she had amazing qualities and knew what she wanted in life. Everyone adored her. She was the baby of, of our family and my little love, my shadow. Now everything we do and everywhere we go is a constant reminder that she is not there with us. All that promise for her future so cruelly taken away. We can now draw a line under seven months of agonising torment that we had to, we have had to endure at the hands of Cashman. Justice has prevailed and I cannot begin to express our relief. I would like to extend our sincere gratitude and thanks to Mr McLaughlin and Mr Riding, the CPS, all the investigation team and police officers involved in working tirelessly to get this to court. My thanks go to the witnesses who bravely assisted the prosecution case and defied the usual stance of people do not grass. I would especially like to thank our family liaison officers, Detective Constable Louise Wright and Julie Moses, who have worked so hard and professionally with boundless dedication to, ach to achieve this result. We welcome the sentence given but what I can say is that my family and I have already started our life sentence, having to spend the rest of our lives without Olivia. We are overwhelmed by the outstanding support of the public during this horrific time and wish to say thank you. We now ask for time and space to try and process what has happened to us over the past few months and most importantly, grief for our Olivia who was so cruelly stolen from us. Father John Francis Pratt, who was completely heartbroken, his older, her older sisters Casey and Kelsey and the rest of the Pratt family. Following the conviction of Cashman and his sentence today, we would like to say we are happy with the outcome, but we will not be celebrating as nothing will fill the gap left in our lives following the loss of Olivia. We would like to thank the jury for the correct verdict and the witness who showed courage and stood up for Olivia by giving evidence. We listen to you. We would also like to thank Merseyside Police and the officers from across the country who assisted in the investigation, the legal team, especially Mr McLachlan, for the hard work in getting justice for our Olivia. We would like to thank our flows, Jamie, Justin and Nicky, for the support they have given my brother and family over the hardest seven months of our lives. Our thoughts are also with the families of Sam Rimmer, Ashley Dale, Jacqueline Russer and Ellie Edwards. We hope you get the justice your loved ones they deserve. Our greatest hope is for this conviction to lead to more guns and especially those used in the murder of Olivia to be handed into the police so that no, no other families must go through this tragedy. Lastly, I would like to say Olivia Pratt Corbell died a scared nine-year-old and we hope Cashman is haunted by this knowledge for the rest of his life. Thank you.